Chess friends, how are you? If I don't post a video on YouTube for one day, it feels like one year has passed, anyway, I played some brilliant chess games with real Magnus Carlsen on Sunday evening where I sacrificed my rook against him. The greatest glory in living lies not in never falling, but in rising every time we fall, so let's go, I started the game with e4, Magnus played c5, knight f3, and here you can play many variations of Sicilian like Old Sicilian, French variation of Sicilian or d6, Hyper Dragon Sicilian is the most popular choice but Magnus chooses to play d6, he build his structure in dark squares which is why I play d4 to open the position. Takes and here I decided to take it with my queen instead of taking it with knight, I just want my queen involvement early on the game, so he played knight c6 with an extra move, you shouldn't play bishop b5 to pin the knight because you may exchange the bishop for the knight, you need light square bishop to attack black in light squares because his center structure is in dark squares, queen e3. Blocking the bishop line but it's not a bad move because the bishop can't really be active in this diagonal, the dark square pawns can force the dark bishop to be passive, we have knight f6 bishop e2 and he decided to push the pawn on e5, it controls the square for the knight entry and it weakens the d6 pawn at the same time, he can push the pawn on his next turn and the problem may solve for him, so I played castle, bishop e7. He didn't play d5 so I played rook d1 quickly to stop black any movement on this file and the pawn, castle c4, blocking pawns pushed permanently to close the position and tries to make a strong outpost for the knight, so bishop g4 knight c4 h6, pausing move and it also prevents any pieces activity on this g5 square, h6 and he takes it, queen takes f3, bishop takes knight would block the rank for the queen, knight d4 queen d3 knight to d7, Magnus Carlsen's knights want to do a nightmare with me. He learned from my videos how to use knights and he tries to apply to me, but a father always be a father, my children's can't defeat me in chess, so bishop e3, knight c5 to target the queen, these knights are looking aggressive but I have no weak structure or undefeated pieces, bishop g5 bishop g4, if you take the bishop let me show you the variation, takes and you have to move back your knight, before and you have to retreat your another knight, the knights will be passive and after bishop takes knight, takes queen takes d6, white will be very much better so back to the position, we have knight e6 first to protect his brother, the knights are the true best friends, and have a best friend named Atal, and chess friends, who is your best friend? Tell me his name in the comments, I will give you a heart, rook f1 with a 4000 elo tactic, ok we have queen a5 rook to b1, queen b4 to target the pawn, here I played f4, critical move for black, if you dare to take the f pawn, let me show you the variation, after pawn takes you will simply lose your knight on d4, you watch daily my videos, you watch Gothamchis and maybe Hikaru Nakamura videos then how can you make blunder? Because you are a donkey, best move is to play bishop f6, then I will play f5, knight g5 b3 b5, h4 knight h7, looks like the knight become a delivery boy but after knight takes b5, takes takes, takes, pawn takes bishop takes, position will be better for white but black maybe manage it, because Magnus is my subscriber, but in our actual game, we have bishop h4, f5 to target the knight and breaking the combination, knight c5 and here you may think, what about bishop takes a5, but it's the best move. If you take the bishop then the queen will arrive on there, f6 and queen checkmate it coming, and after some moves later, we will win up the bishop and the king will be totally passive, the knight is coming to these squares to create problems for black, you might think, what is the bad here, everything is fine for white, the reason why it is bad because, after bishop takes h6, Magnus wouldn't take the bishop with pawn, he will play bishop f6 to hold the position, so in this position, we have f6. Magnus played bishop takes f6, he said where is the attack stockfish, here is the attack fool, rook sacrifice on f6. He takes the rook and his pawn structure and king position is not in the right condition, if you think, bishop takes h6 may be the best move here, it will damage black position but it's not the best move, because after queen takes pawn black will play knight e6 to support this square, back to the position. I played queen f3 patiently to target it, 
and the night is on this great square which I made long time ago, black will be destroyed, so we have f5, knight d5, sacrificing the another piece, the bishop, if you take the bishop then queen f6 will come, knight e6 is a threat to the king, and bishop and queen is line up on there, and chess friends, if you want to play like me and defeat Magnus Carlsen then you can like and subscribe to my channel, so rook e8 to protect that square, bishop takes pawn. Knight e6 to protect it, and ops, what the heck is this? Your queen is hanging since two moves, the game will be over for you, so back to the position, we have queen takes c4, knight e7 check king here, the pawn is hanging but you shouldn't take the pawn, if knight takes check happen then he will take the knight, takes and f6, black will create an escaping route for the king, white is winning but you shouldn't give a single chance to your opponent even if you are winning, so back to the position, you can give your rooks and bishops like this, bishop takes check. If you take the bishop, then after queen h4 check, king backs, check here takes and check, knight takes knight takes f5, and the checkmate is coming in these squares, queen check king here knight e6 to protect it, so queen h6 check king backs knight e7 check and it will be mate, back to the position, we have king h8. Now you can't stop checkmate, if king h7 then bishop takes rook will be a checkmate, Magnus Carlsen decided to resign the game, because after knight f3 check, game will be over in few moves, so wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.